Did you know that suicide is the second leading cause of death for people ages 10 to 34? And according to the CDC, more than half of the people who complete suicide don't have a known mental health condition. If you're having these sort of thoughts, you're not crazy and there is help. So if you are a teen or know a teen who's considering completing suicide, please, please, please watch and share this video today. Hey, welcome back. If you're new here, or you need a refresher. My name is Valerie Grimsey and I'm a teen therapist that's licensed to practice in Connecticut. I am here to help you build confidence and learn healthy coping strategies that actually work. So if that's something you're interested, make sure that you hit subscribe so you never miss a weekly video. You are not alone and we are in this together. So as a teen therapist, you can imagine, I often work with teenagers who are considering or thinking about suicide. You're in a time of your life where there is so much happening. Not only are you going through biological changes, you're going through emotional and lifestyle changes. It's a lot. And when you feel stressed out and overwhelmed, it's not odd to start thinking about how do I escape this situation? That's actually pretty healthy. The part where that thinking about escaping the situation that gets a little dicey or risky is when things feel so overwhelming and so hopeless that thoughts about wanting to be dead or man, life would be better if I was just dead or they would be happier if I weren't here. If those sort of thoughts start popping in, that's where it's time to reach out and get some help. Because thinking about or wishing you were dead and actually wanting to die, it's pretty serious. There isn't an undo or restart button when it comes to death. I need you to know that if you are having any of these thoughts and they're not going away, there is help. You're not crazy. If you or someone you know are considering killing themselves or having thoughts or urges to complete suicide, please call one of these numbers. You can text anything to the crisis text line at 741-741. You can call the National Suicide Prevention Lifeline at 1-800-273-8255. The Trevor Project Lifeline is for LGBTQ plus youth and they can be reached at 1-866-488 seven, three, eight, six. The National Sexual Assault Hotline can be reached at 1-800-656-4673. For those struggling with drug and alcohol abuse, you can call 1-800-662-4673. The Domestic Abuse Hotline is 1-800-799-7233. If you are pregnant, considering, or in the process of completing an abortion, or you've already completed an abortion and are having thoughts of hurting yourself, please text the option line by texting HELPLINE to 313131. If you or someone you know is considering completing suicide or having thoughts or urges to hurt or kill themselves, please call one of these numbers because talking can help. So my dear suicidal teens and the people who love and care about them, please know that you're not crazy and there is help. These are just a few of the helplines that exist in the United States and there are so many more that are probably local to your area as well. If you want even more help or to help a friend who's dealing with their mental health struggles, please go ahead and watch the video on your screen right now. And while you're there, please don't forget to hit subscribe and share this video with anyone else who you think could have benefit. Thanks for watching.